Mindful Mondays with Mrs. V. Let's start the week off together. Hi Spartans, I am back today to speak to you a little bit more about raising awareness on suicide prevention. I understand that for some of you, the topic of suicide may be a little bit triggering and I wanna give you the space to say to your teacher that you need to be excused for the next few minutes and that is totally normal. Uh, but I do wanna to speak to you about this topic because Sadly, every 40 seconds, somebody loses their life to suicide. And so it's a true problem in our society that we need to address and start having conversations around. But um, after this video, I would like for you to walk away with three things that you can do to prevent suicide. And the first one is ask your friend or your loved one if they are struggling. If you suspect that someone is struggling with thoughts of suicide, ask them if they are. That's number one. Number two, listen attentively. That means listening without judging, listening without giving your opinion, but just simply being there for them. And number three, ask them to encourage, encourage them to seek help. There are resources here at school. There are resources nationwide that are available to help out. And you may, you may be thinking and asking yourself, well, how am I supposed to know? I'm not a therapist. That's okay, you don't have to be a therapist. But if you start to notice little changes that make a big difference, that may be an indication that they may be suffering. Some examples can include things like an increased level of aggression, maybe isolation that was not there before, some depression. Maybe somebody's talking to you about suicide or texting or even posting about dying. Um, maybe that person has begun to use drugs and um, any other significant change in behavior, for example, somebody that used to enjoy and be passionate about a sport or an activity that no longer is. All of those are some examples. Of course, it's not a complete list, but those are some indications that something is truly wrong. And so if you suspect that something is going on, ask, listen, and connect them. And next, you're gonna see a graphic that reminds you of those three steps, as well as resources. Thank you so much for watching Spartans and please if you need help or support, we are here to support you, your counselors, the school psychologists and myself. I'll see you on Friday. That was Mindful Mondays with Mrs. V. See you soon Spartans. My name is Seth Gonzalez and I will be your anchor for today. Today's quote is, trust is like a vase. Once it's broken, though you can fix it, the vase will never be the same again. My favorite color is blue. That reminds me, let's start the pledge. Please stand, place your right hand over your heart. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic Up next is the Daily News. I'm Yarani with the Daily News. Attention 7th and 8th grade scholarship students. Are you interested in a field trip? Scholarship will be going to Universal Studios on October 20th. Money and permission slips are due this Friday, September 30th. Please see Ms. Ragusa, Mr. Cortez, Ms. Browser, Ms. Edwin, or Ms. Ragusa to turn them in. Again, this Friday, money and permission slips are due. For information or permission slips, see Mr. Cortez, Ms. Ms. Ragusa, or the office. Thank you. This Thursday is Club Day at Lunch Spartans. Come by the quad this Thursday at lunch to check out some of the clubs here at Stafford. Clubs include Safe Space, Lego Club, Compass Club, Feminier Club, and many more. See you in the quad at lunch on Thursday. Next week is Spartan Kindness Week. Dress up all week to have a chance to win a prize. On Monday, wear red. Tuesday, wear pajamas. On Wednesday, dress as your favorite movie or book character. Thursday is Twin Day and Friday is Scavenger Hunt Day. Let's show how much we care, Spartans, and dress up next week. 
Once again, my name is Seth Gonzalez. Today's quote is, trust is like a vase. Once it's broken, though you can fix it, the vase will never be the same again. Don't forget to read, lead, and succeed. So long, Spartans.